Hello, hello! Coming to you from the yurt. So, today's project. I am going to be retrofitting the tanu cover for a, uh, a bigger insulated stove pipe because right now the stove pipe is, well, you can't see it now, but it was right in here and it was getting really close to this and you know it was a hot stove pipe so I couldn't bring the tanu cover to cover everything so when it um, rained or uh, any time it would um, it would get really hot and I wouldn't want the cover on there so what I'm doing is come way down here to get the tools and then go way back up there and I'll probably forget something and I'll have to come all the way down here again but that's how I'm rolling for now uh, it's really not that bad you come back up here and try to make the cut Down to finish it. And you don't want to watch this board. Okay, so that really sucks. I just broke the, the little bit on the Dremel. They break often, but that happened to me on the last one. So, quick little lesson, especially when you're out in the middle of nowhere. Um, get backups. And I tend to do that, but I don't have backups for everything. So, rule of thumb going forward, and I, which I've been practicing for a while now, is to double up on my replacements like when I bought the broke the chainsaw blade I uh, bought two this way I always have a backup so I think what the saying is uh, one is none two is two is one three is more four is uh, whatever but the point is uh, it would have been really nice if I just added backups on these little now I'm stuck and it's not really I think it's gonna rain, but you never know. And now I'm Okay. <clears throat> so I got the part and just need those little discs. Uh yeah, and I got them, and I got a little kit, and I got a couple extra, and so I cut it out, and then that happened. That is what we call a sunset. Anyway, so now this will go on to here, like that, and then it'll be angled. See, like that. I might have to adjust a little bit, but I think this is going to be perfect. Let's try it on over there. Gotta go way back down over there. See how it doesn't have a little chimney now? So sad. Poor little cold yurt. I'm coming, yurt! Oh, woke up some dogs. Alright. So, see the sunset one last time? We'll just get Billy Ray in there. Oh, yeah. Billy Ray in the sunset. And generator. That's the generator I have, people. Yamaha EF 3000 ISEB inverter. It has the adapter down there to go from natural gas to propane. Propane, man. That's the bad boy right there. Alright. Let me get back to work. Oh, look, the moon's out too. Beautiful day. Okay, so there is the finished product. That silver part of the exhaust pipe is a insulated piece 
so it won't heat up the wood that's right there and I can move the tanu cover all the way to wrap it when it's uh, really cold out and then this way it won't catch on fire so there's the the stove I'm gonna burn a little fire here show you how it's done I'm gonna open up the fluke there's a dog and what I did was I put newspapers down then some cardboard then some smaller sticks and some bigger sticks and then some even bigger sticks so should just take one little light like some there right on the bottom here I should have probably put that one piece in. Alright, so you close it. And then you can see, wow, look at that right there. You can see the air getting sucked in. That's how you get that working. Once you get the wood nice and hot, right, turn up a little bit more. You get a little hot in there. Uh, you could close this, and that'll hold the heat in. Maybe a little like that for now. And then uh, you close this. To slow down the slow down the burn. Look at hiccups. And then that's what keeps it lit all night. So there's my new uh, little bit of safety I have in the yurt. All right, guys. Please, I hope you're enjoying the videos. Please comment anything below. Anything you'd like to see? Anything you like me doing? You don't like me doing? Share it with your friends, anybody that knows things about things like this. I could use some help. And uh, it's always fun making these videos for everybody. So pass the word out. Share it on Facebook. Share it on YouTube. Like it, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. And I will see you guys later.